All right, finally, we have my boy DBZ Skills providing us some ultimate Gohan Spark and Zero gameplay. Now, Skills is pretty good at the game. Me and him went to uh, some conventions previously, and uh, that guy knows his stuff. He knows how to play. And dude, if you haven't seen us get like a bajillion like uh, of the medals for Spark and Zero, right? He's been even to more conventions than me. And on top of that, um, this guy is getting some exclusive footage at Gamescom. So I'm going to go ahead and take a look here just for you guys in case you haven't seen it. And of course, feel free to make sure to check out DBZ skills here. Um, this guy is just great at the game and he's going to be writing more, more content just like I am for this game. So um, let's hop right into this. So again, Ultimate Gohan is a character I've been very much looking forward to. And I think, you know, Ultimate Gohan looks like he's going to be a good character. Uh, hopefully he is peak as stated here. Um, of course, let's see. So at PAX West, there are the new characters that we didn't have at the Evo, at the um, Anime Expo demos, at the, all the other demos before uh, Gamescom. Actually, this is PAX West, my bad. I said Gamescom earlier. Um, but this is indeed PAX West. So we're going to see some perfect Cell gameplay as well. I think that's super perfect Cell, actually. Or... Yeah, actually, I think in game his name is Perfect Cell, but the other cell cell perfect form, right? Let me double check that here, uh, just because I, I, I want to make sure I refer them to the correct name in the game. Uh, so in the game, it is uh, we can't even see his name. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is Perfect Cell, although the other one is Perfect Form Cell, but they are actually separate character slots. You can see that this cell is an entirely different separate character. You can't transform from Perfect Form Cell to Perfect Cell, right? Uh, the one with the lightning, you can't actually transform into them. We got Videl here. Actually, uh, Skills told me that Videl feels pretty good as well, or he, he said so. So we're going to go ahead and take a look there. And of course, the enemy boot tanks makes a lot of sense. Unfortunately, you know, I get the watermark, but it is in the way of the uh, <laughs> of the actual dialogue that I would have liked to see. But it is what it is. Ginyu as well. Yeah, again, there's a lot of characters that we can get a lot of gameplay for because in the original demo, right? You know, of course, um, I think we saw a lot of the characters so many different times. I mean, to be honest, I saw some gameplay that I never really uploaded, but um. At least we can still see it now. Be honest with yourself. Don't look rather impressive now. Okay, okay. And then what does Gohan say? Um, <laughs> wait, does it say, I guess it doesn't make you look any less stupid. That's crazy. Bro is, <laughs> bro is doing that talk. Okay, okay. So, all right. It looks like he has uh, some pretty decent strings right there. Um, skills was able to uh, evade out of the way there. Yeah, this this game just it seems faster, right, compared to the previous builds that I had experience playing. Um, so that's great to see. All right, so okay, he barely was missed getting hit by uh, I think the booze beam right there. I, don't, I think was that a paralyzed beam? I can't really say for sure. Um, so he has wild sense. Well, let me take a look here. So ultimate Gohan skill set right here. I think if I could take a look, I would like to take a quick look here because it's important to know. So Wild Sense, uh, which is, you know, we'll take Wild Sense. Power up to the very limits. That is really good because Sparking Mode in this game, again, if you guys didn't know, is very powerful because, like, it's, a tr you're able to just mash square. It's actually a true combo. And then you can get, like, like at least like two health bars of damage or something like that like a health bar and a half to two health bars of damage and then you can just knock him down and throw an ultimate at him <laughs> it can be very nasty so having the ability to go instantly into power up to the very limit or uh, with the sparking mode I, I is what i was trying to say um is really really good uh so okay skills try to do the charge up attack but it was a little too far right there that's fine that's fine all right got him stunned oh Boo Tanks has explosive wave. Nah, man, explosive wave is gonna be terrible. Ooh, okay, knocked him back. Doing some, <laughs> doing some ultimate Gohan back shots. Okay, okay, he's cooking. He's cooking. Um, got him with the perception right there. We would love to see it. We love to see it. Okay. Oh, well, if only he got a revenge counter right there. That would have been awesome. Yeah, revenge counter is one thing that's like a little weird. If you're not thinking about it, like at the top of your head, you might just forget about it, especially with how much faster this game is now. Uh, revenge counter, you kind of have to like, it's something I'm going to have to get used to myself, like really understanding how these other, um, what's it called? Like, what's it called? Wait, 
it's called um no uh, super perception is what i'm trying to say we used he used the power up to the very limit it, it's been a while since i actually looked at sparking zero gameplay to be honest and recorded of them so i forgot some of the terms but no super perception is what i'm trying to say it's a little weird to get used to revenge counter is very easy to do uh yeah because right here you can see it's just very weird and this is one thing i just have said a lot of times in the past where it's like the cornering near the walls could be very weird very very odd like the angle of the camera is super weird and the vanishing is just like what's going on like i'm sure skills thought that would have connected because it was actually doing a combo but unfortunately the hit didn't actually uh reach to ginyu because the wall was in the way so that's awesome um okay so ginyu keeps doing the revenge counter right there and yeah, what I was talking about is super perception. Same, you know, triangle circle if you're on classic mode, the triangle circle. Um, I forgot the exact one on standard specifically, but I think it's um No Revenge Counter is uh L1L1, my bad. I think I, I keep mixing up the two. Y'all, I'm a fraud. I guess I don't know what to say. And again, power up to the very limit again. Uh, I think he's trying to show off the ultimate here. No, this is the burst rush. Is burst rush the ultimate actually? I, it probably is, huh? Yeah, because it's Super Kamehameha Fierce Combination and Burst Rush. Now, personally, in my opinion, the Burst Rush could have looked better. I, I, I think that 100% the Burst Rush could have looked a lot better than it actually does in the game. Because uh, if, like, there's the old Ultimate Gohan Burst Rush that's like, I almost want to, like, bring it up real quick. The old Burst Rush. Let me... Okay, I found a video with a uh, BT2 and the BT3 version. Like, just in a comparison, I feel like they're just a lot more hits. And it feels like more like an actual rush. You know what I mean? The other one, he does, like, a very little amount of attacks. And then, uh, like, it goes into Kamehameha, like, really quickly. Like, look at look at the swag here, dude. Oh, my God. Look at him cook. And then right here, the Kamehameha. Yeah, I don't know. That looks... That I feel like that just looks way better overall even the dokkan one looks really sick <laughs> yeah, the dokkan one right i think because like the amount of attacks he's doing and i think the impact feels really high here then you see the coming after like that compared to um this one right here it's just like he, he does like two attacks and like he you once kicks him and then punches him away that last kick looked pretty nice, but I don't know. I think it could have been longer or I think in general, the impacts in this game, not really like crazy, but may maybe you disagree. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. So, okay. We see Videl here, uh, which we have like, no one's used Videl actually, which is really funny. Uh, I don't know where that cell is. He's trying to find them as well. Okay. Yeah. There's a cell right there. All right. So let's see how Videl's looking like. I don't know could videl use key blast you can use key blast okay that's awesome um wasn't 100 percent sure it makes sense because videl could obviously use key <laughs> you just kick them in the face and that's it <laughs> okay that's the videl kick right there okay we see we see that okay all right he should be able to win this i'm assuming yeah awesome Ooh, okay the revenge counter with cell yeah okay now i'm actually using the right terms guys aren't you proud of me okay <laughs> let's keep going let's keep going all right uh I mean, this is just like him trying to connect a combo right there. Ooh, okay. Uh, nice. That was a charge move, but then it got a perception right there. Pretty sick to see. All right, that combo did look like it connected. Cell used a power-up move. I don't, I don't know what move that is exactly, but I guess we do know he has a move that gives buffs. I'm not really sure if those moves that give buffs are worth it. I would assume probably not. That's crazy. But imagine Videl beating Cell. <laughs> she shows up and steals her father's skill. That's wild. Okay. But um nah, I, I, like in general, like those like attacks that would give um like buffs to you. I think most of the time they're, you're probably just way better off just like saving them for the sparking mode. Or like yeah, pretty much just saving them for the sparking mode. Because the sparking mode just is way more useful than just getting those buffs specifically, right? Or, you know, like, let's say Explosive Wave, if you have that on a character, right? I don't know if Cell specifically has Explosive Wave. Yeah, I wish I could uh, see the move list of these characters before they're actually chosen. Um, maybe I'll ask Skills to get, like, a recording of just looking through all the characters. In fact, I'm, like, literally when he's starting, I'm going to DM him about it at Skills. Gets a recording of... 
all the characters in the demo and the move lists with them, please. Like I did that one. Okay. Um. Anyways, there's a special. Let me let me go back. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get that. But I uh, I wanna. But there is a special dialogue. Bob Bridge just says he <laughs> uh, That was weird. <laughs> That's what it's like. And then uh, Ultimate Gone is like, you'll pay for what you did to her. Um, which is fair. I mean, that was crazy. Okay, so Uspovich uh, got behind him. Okay, okay, I see. That, yeah, this is yeah, this right here. That's Dragon Ball. <laughs> that that's this is Dragon Ball movement. To see that with Spovich was Ultimate Gone of all characters is kind of crazy. But there we go. <laughs> um, he seems to have like the general amount of health. Ultimate Gohan doesn't also seem to have like that much health compared to other characters if i'm not mistaken right he seems to just have the three health bars right um yeah it seems these these both both of these guys have the three amount of health bars which is fair i haven't seen any like vegeto gameplay like too in depth right I, i've seen i've seen like in vegeto supers like that i've seen some clips but actually that's one thing i need to pay attention more to like the health because obviously the more health you have that's gonna be a lot better right or if your character has little health all right, um, I wonder if we could see any of the other moves that Ultimate Gohan does have here. But for now, we're just seeing his combo strings, which is definitely fine with me, right? I mean, seeing Ultimate Gohan just like in general in this game finally is something that I've been waiting for for a very long time. So that's why I was actually very excited to make this video. Okay, Spopovich giving himself a buff. I wonder what that, what does this blue buff do right here? Like, is there, is it like a negative thing for him? I don't see anything. Is he auto regenerating key? I mean, because... Okay, he switched out to uh, First Storm, so interesting. I don't know if he was auto-regenerating key, or is that a thing that just happened? The Cell over here looks like he might be. I can't really tell, honestly. Let me know, guys, if you saw anything special from that Spobovich buff. It might just... It might not be... It might be something completely different, because... Let me let me take a look. It looked like, like a charging thing, right? Yeah, it looks like, you know, like an aura thing with... I don't know, bro. Um... Because he was knocked down earlier, right? Like, as soon as... Well, he's recharging key now. Well, that's because he's, like, attacking, right? I don't know. Let's, let's just keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, probably not that, right? But... Because usually it's, like... If I'm not mistaken, only androids would, like, recover key if they're just standing, obviously. Because they can't charge, right? Ooh, okay. He knocked him down. We're going to see Burst Rush again. Which is fine, right? I would like to see the... Oh, again, the, uh, there's he has super combat ha then he has one other move as well Yeah, the fierce combination. I would like to see that again. Come on, bro. Show me the fierce combination, please skills <laughs> you, <laughs> I'm from the future past Dragon Ball skills uh, Dragon Ball Z skills, please, bro. I'm begging you. <laughs> I'm begging you. All right. He's just knocking him around uh, Yeah, this is, this is this is why spark mode is really stupid. Look at the amount of damage you got this that's crazy 26 hits by the way it's wild okay um okay there he is right there we found him actually no never mind uh why why did it show that oh there's the key though yeah all right spopovich is back here we're gonna do three times with the ultimate i i chat i feel like we're not gonna get the uh unfortunately the combination now <clears throat> oh wait no there's still a super blue huh is it going to switch to Videl again? Yep, there it is. Well, I guess seeing Videl gameplay here is also really, really nice, right? Because no one no one really showed Videl off. <laughs> like, that's the first time I saw the Videl kick. I, I don't think anyone has shown off the Videl kick, which is kind of crazy. And I don't know if anyone's actually shown off Videl's ultimate attack. I assume skills will at least show off the ultimate here because um, he wanted to make sure he gets gameplay on his channel for stuff that you know some people may not have seen like ultimate gohan's burst rush some people may not have seen videl's kick like I, I i personally have not seen it maybe it's somewhere on the internet and it's like i just like missed it right um either way videl actually is kind of saucy right here okay <laughs> but videl is low-key putting the hands on boo oh that was crazy the, the back hit right i mean like a lot of characters can do that but it just looks cool when videl is doing it i feel like oh super unyielding spirit does give her sparking mode huh that's good. After image strike. We'll take after image strike too, right? I mean, it could be better, I guess, but it's like she's a human, so she probably wouldn't have explosive wave. Alright, come on, buddy. Land the ult. Oh, I think he was trying to land the ult right there, but it did not work. Still has 
a bar though, right? So that can be useful. But that only looks like she has two health bars, by the way. Okay, here's the ultimate. Almost done. And there it is. So this is the... She's just going to kick him back to the ground again. Okay. What is the ultimate called? Are the... Like, I don't remember the name for the ultimate at the top of my head again. Because, um... This is a character I haven't played. So I don't remember, like, what exactly the names are. And it is called... I can't see it. It was probably earlier here when she was in spark mode earlier. It is like, okay, well, I, I want to get the name of the ultimate here. Videl Rush is what it's called. Well, that, that makes sense. Videl Kick, Videl Rush. Yeah. Okay, um, that is the gameplay here. Uh, thanks again to DBZ Skills for providing this. If you have have some candy, not people. I wish I could see what the rest of the quote is. Thank you all for watching. Uh, let me know what you think of Ultimate Gohan and Videl in this gameplay. Uh, looked very good, and I'll catch you guys next time.